Hi friends, it's Miss Rachel here. I hope you guys are having an awesome afternoon. I'm here to read you a story about a little girl named Marisol that had to paint the sky for an art project at school. The problem is she doesn't have any blue paint. Well, let's see how she figures it out and what the sky ends up looking like. So, I want you to take a break, get a drink or a snack, sit back and relax while I read you Sky Color. Marisol was an artist. She loved to draw and paint. She even had her very own art gallery on her refrigerator. <laughs> Not all her art hung in a gallery, much of it she shared with the world. She painted posters to share ideas she believed in. At school, Marisol was famous for her creative clothes, her box of art supplies, and her belief that everyone was an artist. Yes, Marisol was an artist, through and through. So when her teacher told the class they were going to paint a mural for the library, Marisol couldn't wait to begin. The classroom buzzed with the sound of brainstorming. The students talked and sketched. Together they made a great big drawing. Then they marched to the library. I'll paint a fish. I'll paint one too. I'll paint the ocean. Marisol shouted real loud. I'll paint the sky. Marisol rummaged through the box of paint but could not find any blue. How am I going to make the sky without blue paint? Marisol thought. The bell rang. It was time to put their brushes down for the day. As she climbed aboard the bus, Marisol kept wondering. All the way home, she stared out of the window. The sun lowered closer to the horizon, and that sky is orange and yellow. Later at home, Marisol watched day turn into night. And look at that sky. I don't see any blue. There's pinks, it looks like a dark red, oranges, and yellows. That night, Marisol settled into a deep sleep. She drifted through a sky, swirling with colors. The colors mixed, making too many to count. In the morning, Marisol stood, waiting for the bus in the rain. The sky was not blue today, and she smiled. At school, Marisol raced to the library. She grabbed a dish and began adding colors. This one, then that one. She swirled the brush to make an altogether new color. Marisol then began painting on the wall. A boy asked, what color is that? That, Marisol said, that is sky color. Whoa, look how beautiful her sky is that she painted. Look at all the different colors she decided to use. Wow, that's so beautiful. The end. I hope you guys enjoyed this story and I hope you had fun figuring out how to paint the sky without blue like Marisol did and how beautiful that painting mural turned out to be. Well I hope you guys have fun with all the activities I've sent you this week and I hope you continue to color and paint and dance and listen to music and make music and I will talk to you all next week. Thank you so much. I'll see you later. Bye.